welcome to the Preacher Plays Elden Ring Blind. We've gone through... I don't even know if that village had a name. No, we didn't. But at the last episode, we went through the Volcano Cave. <clears throat> it was one of the larger demi-humans there at the bottom of the boss, as a boss. And uh, he gave me a cannon, but uh, I can't use it. I just don't have the stats for it. So perfectly all right. It's, it's fine. I'll survive. I'm at the ninth. Mount Gelmer campsite. I actually did not really intend to spend all of my time over here in Volcano Manor, but hey, I'm here, so it seems foolish not to proceed. Now, we've got two options. There is, right over there, a ladder. I mean, why not? And this says there's a boss ahead. And there's a spring. Is that a uh, I can't see. Is that just a message? I think that's a message that somebody wrote. Hold on. <clears throat> or is that a beetle? No, it's a message. On the side of the wall. Okay, well, hats off or props to whoever thinks that they can put messages in some of the weirdest places ever. I want to see if up this way there is an item. Oh, nope. The only item up here is death. Raise a butterfly. I don't see any butterfly. I thought I saw an Oh, right there. Nascent butterflies. I don't remember what they're made what you make with them, but uh yay. Okay, good. Well, here's what I'm thinking. I could climb that ladder and it's the long way up. Or I could bounce up there and figure out um <coughs> maybe see what I'm going to be looking at. So let's just, uh, let's just see. Oh, 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 it's a star beast. Oh, full grown falling star beast. Okay. Okay, good. Um, this, this, this is not what, no. Um, hold on there, dude. Um, I don't even know if he can be poisoned. Where are we at here? I'm st I'm starting to get I'm starting to get dizzy. I am not seeing poison being a natural problem. Oh wait, wait, he is poisoned. Ow! 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 Okay, okay. How about how about we don't? How about we don't and we say that we didn't? I have no idea if this is even worth my while. You know, I think something a little bit beefier than whoa. But I don't know what else to call. So let me just see if... Oh, I didn't need to drink that. Ow. Oh, yeah. It's not going well for him, is it? Okay. Ow. Ow. My everything. Ow, my life. Okay, hold on. Okay. <clears throat> what do you do with a full-grown falling star beast? I never did figure out exactly what these guys were weak to. But I have a feeling magic is going to be, in one of its forms, what I need here. Um. Um. Hmm. Let me think. What? What? Nope. What spells? Okay. Probably don't have room for that. I 
kind of get the feeling that fire in general is not going to do much to them. He's using some kind of gravity. Um, probably not going to get anything out of lead. Uh, maybe lightning? Maybe lightning? I don't know about... I can try those. What else do I have here that might be triable? You know what? Poison. Poison might be something. I don't know. Let me let me let me think about that. This is going to be a, a experimental until I figure some things out for him. And I could do that. Lintstone breath. I'm probably going to use the smaller versions of these. They do more damage if they're bigger, but <clears throat> they also take more FP, and I want to be able to... Ooh, you know what? Also... Um, that's an option. Alright, between all of these, I may be able to... No way, I want to change the flasks a little bit. I want to make sure... Yeah. This is, this is not going to be about taking hits anyhow. I have a sneaking suspicion. I wonder if you can sleep him. I have my doubts. I have my doubts. But I have some sleep pots there. So I kind of want... I kind of want to test that. And I also... I'm going to use a couple of meat dumplings here. Assuming I don't actually poison myself, should be maybe kind of sort of an option. And maybe, yeah, okay. Now, um, I don't know also about the type of attacks. This guy was not the right guy. <clears throat> what about Carmen? Or what about... Almost anything I throw up there is going to be difficult. Um, I mean, he's my best bet just because he's beefy. But um, I have my doubts. <clears throat> let's, let's start with poison armament. Can I? No, I can't. Okay, I got it. <laughs> I've got to be off the horse in order to do it. And um, from there... Ow! That was my horse. Okay. Well, he's not poisoned. So there's an observation. I mean, I did hit him three or four times, and I don't know how poison prone he is, but... Oh, and I also lost my runes. It's alright. It's alright. Get used to the idea that runes are going to get lost along the way, and you'll be okay. I am going to try lightning this time, and uh, let's just see... Um, I mean, 314, that was not great damage. All right. Now we are going to... Is, uh, did I lock him into a... Ow. I kind of doubt it. All right, just to... Uh... 
All right. Ow. Uh, yes, please. Give me... Give me a drink. Um... All right. Ow. Yeah, so nothing. Okay, ow. Okay, nothing. Okay. <laughs> yeah, my pumpkin head is, is, is not faring well either, but uh, he is, he's the beefiest thing I've got here. I need a I need a plan. I need something that's going to let me think here. It is not going to be and I've almost got too many things going on here. I I didn't test the black flame, but I have my doubts. So let's we'll see about some of these. I'm probably going to start off with that. And then if I need to, I can come back around. Um, what about... Hmm, trying to think about... I kind of doubt that's going to do much damage either, but I want to try it. If I can. We're going to figure this out. Cue death montage, because I have a feeling... I have a feeling that's what it's going to take. I am going to use that, and I'm going to leave the shield on. I have a feeling that I need the shield. And let's go. Ow! All right. I do want that applied. Did not mean to jump off like that. What I do want to do... Uh, not, not the best damage. Um, also, not the best damage. Let me see if... I'm not sure I did much damage to him. Ow! All right, Mad Pumpkin. Okay, wait a minute. That actually did pretty good. Ow. All right. This is... I can go around him. Go around him. Continue going around him. Ow. No, 
no, no, no, no, I don't think I can survive that. I don't think I can survive that. I don't think I can survive it. Please don't, please don't, please don't, please don't. Okay. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. No, no. Ow. Okay. Do I not have the ability to call? Okay. Okay, watch that. Better to be poisoned, I think. Ugh. Okay. Two, three. Okay. Please no. Okay. Dog on it. Okay. I need to be able to get underneath him, I think. Even though I want to dodge away, you have to dodge into him. That's the real challenge. I think that is the real challenge. Hmm. Okay. Um, I need to get just one more, I think, healing. But then again, I'm not entirely certain it's going to make that big of a distance difference. Seven flasks ought to be enough to deal with this. I still think pumpkin head is my best bet. Let's get rid of that. And <clears throat> just in general, I think stamina is going to help. I think stamina is going to help, and we will see. Hmm. Let me think about this real quick. Let's go. Let's just let's just see. Oh, man. Well, you can't even get up. You can't even get up. Hmm. Wow, I died so fast, I didn't even have a chance to get up there. Um, let me... What would be a fitting... Ooh, I could do some of that. Let's try Magic Grease. Oh, really? Okay. Let's just do this real quick. Ow.
All right. No. Got to stay underneath him. And don't panic roll. Ow. And sometimes you can't stay underneath him. Okay. Come on. Okay, come on. Come on. Got to stay right up on this. Come on. Got him. I got him. I got him. Oh my gosh. I got him. I got him. That is the most overpowered Falling Star Beast Jaw, Smith Stone 6, Somber Smithing Stone 6. Oh. That is a weapon. It's probably a strength weapon. And it's one that I can't use, but Whew. let's see. 34 strength, 20 int. <clears throat> Heart of a falling star beast jaw, hard and shining black, fashioned into a weapon. With its sharp point, this colossal weapon can skewer bows. Unique skill gravity bolt, imbue the jaw of the falling star beast with gravitational lightning. Sending a bolt crashing down a short distance away can be fired in rapid succession. Well. Oh, yeah. Gosh, I really wish I had the stats for that. That is... <clears throat> that is... Beastly, but I don't have the stats for it. <clears throat> Okay, um, I'm willing to bet that this is another one of those starlight whatevers. Yeah, I can't, can't do that. Really? Ah, let me, <laughs> let me get that off. I don't think that's the problem, but. Yeah, oh, come on. Whew. Okay. Surely that is Volcano Manor that I'm looking at. Yep. Yep. It's miserable. I hate it. Ugh. Wow. That is hmm. close-ranged battle. 
a stone astrolabe. Yes, I think that's what that is. Uh, I can no longer, I can no longer zoom that way. That was very, and he was only worth twenty-two thousand runes. I think he would have been worth a whole lot more. Okay. <clears throat> I don't know. Um, yes, but if you don't have a horse, this is the only way to get down. Well, or, you know, warp around. <clears throat> there was a promontory out here I wanted to walk. Whoops. I want my 200 runes. It was over here. And I want to walk out on it. Because I kept thinking, man, it'd be fun to walk out on. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Is this how... Yep. Yep. Oh, that's the entrance to Volcano Manor. Let's take a look while we're here. <clears throat> now that looks like a spot that I can get out on. As does that. So somehow, there is a way to climb. There is a way to climb. But... Maybe not much of one. This is, uh, I mean, really, in terms of a defensible spot, this is a defensible spot. All right. Jump, jump, jump. So there will be a way for me to get out on the roof here. And probably have a bunch of those octagonal-looking crows. <clears throat> have a bunch of those marionette soldiers or something like them laying around. Yeah, they're hanging up there. So there's probably a bunch on the rooftop as well. Um, man, the crows look really bad. Um, let's see, up here. And... <clears throat> statue over there. Okay, well... This may be about as good. And I can probably get there with my horse, but not not without my horse. So let's uh Let's go get some restored stuff. I gotta put some stuff back on my hotbar as well. For memory. I gotta memorize a couple of spells. Well, these guys are really, really good. <clears throat> and, oh man, I do wish I could use it. That's right. Um, I need some... Well, let's see. Electrify Armament should be good. But my favorite of all time is this one. And, well, you know what? Hold on. Let's, let's put this here and this one in the last spot, because then I can back up to it really really easily. <clears throat> Beast Claw. Let's, let's, let's mesh with that. Mesh? Let's mesh with that for just a minute. Um, put my back. Oh, I went right, went, 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 went. There we go. Okay. Okay. Not a huge cost. I wonder what kind of damage it actually does. Okay. Well, for me to go into Volcano Manor is not a problem at all. I don't really need to jump that and then make my way over. Unless, uh, unless there's something up there that you can't see unless you're on the mount. Yeah. 
So this is kind of an escape. Whoops, come on, come on, come on. I just wanted to read that. Read. There we go. Castle ahead. You are brilliant. I rode ahead. Likely down. You are correct. Golly, that was um, totally sloppy. That was also totally sloppy. And I'm really just coming back where I had been earlier. <clears throat> Take care of you. If I had a shield that I could use for casting, I would. There we go. And I don't think anything is going to be gained by killing that giant, but, you know. It might be. It might be. I doubt it. And if I lose my runes, I can always come back and... I don't have that many, uh, that many heals on me. And that pretty much solves that problem. I hate those things. All right. Um, <laughs> okay, they're funny. They are funny. Well... My loop around the Altus Plateau brought me back to Volcano Manor, a place that I do not intend necessarily to stay at. But I should at least see if Patches has anything new for me. Hello again. I doubt it. I doubt it entirely. I have no idea if I need that. You know, maybe I can use it later. It seems like such a waste. But uh, how many of those guys do I have? Come on. I have 17. And I haven't used them much. And I love the S-Doc. But I'm not going to use it. 
am I? Last shards? Mm, probably not, although you do use... I'm just going to double my holdings. Um, you do use those for some items. Gosh. How many of those do I have? You know what? And, uh... There we go. I, I, I've i spent my junk. Yep, 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 yep. I don't have to go to a grace point in order to fast travel. I keep, I keep forgetting that. All right. So, what have we done here? We started out, I think over here was Wyndham Village, worked our way around Seathwater River, traveled to the Craftsman Shack, made our way around all of this. I think, or we actually made our way this way. Hermit Village, yes. Wyndham Catacombs, we did it earlier. We finally made our way up from the Hermit Village, yes, to the Primeval Sorcerer Azure, crossed over to Gilmer Hero's Grave. We found the first Mount Gilmer campsite, and we've crossed our way over into the Volcano Manor after we killed that beast. So, not much going on down here with the Road of Iniquity. I don't think I even need to go back there. There wasn't much for me to pick up. Just a bunch of those stupid, yucky, gross hands. And I think that means... I think that means, aside from trying to do things here in the castle, I'm kind of done. Even though there's a lot more for me to do here in Volcano Manor. I don't necessarily know that I want to do it. I kind of want to get back to doing the Eastern or at least central part of the Ultus Plateau. So let's start working at clearing this area out. Um, I went here. We have Bach the Seamster is here. What else? Urtree Gazing Hill. We met Millicent there, although I'm not really sure. Ooh, I know there is a cavern there. So let's... I'm assuming that this is where we have to go. Altus Highway Junction. I want to go south on that road just a little bit. I want to make sure that we've covered that road or if I didn't just race to it. But uh, I'll do that maybe the next time. We got the full star, full size falling star beast, which means that one that's on the side of Laernia or Ladle Castle over where was it over here I'll bet you we can get that one if I just work hard at it but we will worry about that the next time I hope that you are enjoying Elden Ring I hope you're able to play it along and I do hope that I will see you the next time